Hey guys, so I'm here in my room filming you the how to fold your clothes video. It's taken me about two years to get around to film this. Sorry about that. Um, but here it is. So if you want to find out how to fold everything from your jeans, shirts, jackets, long sleeves, even your underwear, please stay tuned. Alright guys, so the reason why um, taking me so long to film this video is because I'm horrible at explaining, so please bear with me. This is a t-shirt, so I'm just gonna show you guys how to fold this first. So I'm gonna turn it around to the back, and I'm gonna take one side, fold it over this way. The bottom should be right in front of you. So I have this camera right next to me. See, this is like my arm, I'm reaching over and everything. So, um, this should be away from you, this should be right in front of you. I'm going to take this side now, and I'm going to bring it right over so they meet up right in the middle. You can kind of press it down, it kind of uh, almost irons it with your hands. I'm going to bring the bottom and pull it all the way up, okay? And then I'm going to do that one more time. If you look right here, this right here is going to enable it to stay standing up, which is how I get them to stand in my drawers. So, if you do this for all your clothes, all your shirts, they will stand like this, especially when there's a lot of them all together like this. This is just a long sleeve. This is the front of it. Turn it around to the back. Kind of Make sure everything's nice and flat. Okay. I'm going to take this side, just as I would with a t-shirt. This is about two inches right here, depending on how thick your shirt is. Mine, um, I fold it over about two inches. I'm going to bring the sleeve over, just like this. I'm going to take the bottom of the sleeve right here, and I'm going to put it right down to the corner like this. And you'll notice kind of has this little almost like a L shape right here. I'm going to take this little corner and just fold it over like that. So I'll show you that again with this side. I'm just going to take this, fold it over just like I would with a t-shirt, take the sleeve and just drag it across. And I'm going to take this gonna fold it over, bring it toward the corner of the bottom of the shirt, take around where the elbow is, and just flip it like that. Now I'm just gonna fold it up, and voila! It stands. Of course it's much thicker material, so looks a little pudgy when it stands, but when there's a lot of them together, it'll shrink down like this, saving you tons of room. For shorts, I just like to fold them over once. <laughs> and just, um, I like to stack my shorts personally because they're on a shelf, so I just, it's easier for me to find them that way. If you were going to fold your shorts all fancy though, you could bring it over like this, just as you would with the shirt. Bring it over once. There you go. Same effect. I'm going to show you how to fold a workout shirt just because they are a little bit more um, difficult to fold because the material is much thicker. This is just the front of it. Bring it to the back like this. Okay. Take right where the armpit is. Fold it over a little bit like that, just like I would with any other shirt. And do the same thing. I'm going to take it Fold it up, just like that, and I'm going to take it a little bit past the middle, like that, or else it's going to be too short. If I took it in the middle, that's very short, to me anyways. My um, drawers go up to about here, so I want them to be a little bit deeper, so just like that, and they do stand like this once again with the other shirts behind it. Alright, now is when things might get weird for you. Um, I find that's a little 
uncomfortable for people to fold their underwear. I don't really understand why. Um, I find that saves me tons of time in the morning just to go through and find um, my underwear that's desired. <laughs> so this is my underwear. Um, you don't have to fold your underwear. It's just something I do and I know some other people might be interested in doing. This is the front of it. Just going to take it to the back. These are kind of a boy short hip hugger style. I'm going to show you how to fold first. I'm going to take this edge, fold it over a third. I'm going to fold this edge over a third. So it's almost like a little sandwich, okay? Take the bottom, fold it over once, so it's like a little square. And I'm going to fold this in the middle. So you almost have a nice little package like this. And they stand just like that, but I don't like to stand them, I just like to stack them like that. Same thing kind of goes for thongs and whatnot. Um, so I'm just going to take it, this is the back of it, fold over the sides into thirds, fold this up once, okay, and I'm going to fold it up one more time. There you go, nice little package. Alright, as far as jeans go, I have a pair of jeans right here. This is the front of them, okay, and this is the back. What I like to do is take my jeans and fold them so that the pockets are facing outwards, okay? Alright, and then I'm just going to take it and I'm just going to make sure it's flat and fold it in half. So the top meets up with the bottom, but I like the pocket to um, to show out on the outer on the outer edge like this. Then what I do is take my hanger and just slide it into the bottom like this, just like that. And I have my pockets all facing the same direction, and that's how I organize them in my closet. I forgot to mention, as for sweaters, I just hang them in my closet. Um, if you look at my How to Organize Your Closet video, um, I actually just keep my, my sweaters on the left side of my closet. Alright guys, this is definitely my most requested video ever. I'm so sorry it took me um, about two years to get around to film it. I just, I don't know, I'm really bad at explaining things and I don't know, I was just kind of dreading it a little, but it actually wasn't that bad, I don't think. Um, I want to apologize for the squeaky floor. I just listened to it um, on my camera, and um, if you listen, I don't know if you can hear that, but my floor does squeak in that certain place where I was filming. I don't know why, <laughs> but um, there's nothing I can really do about it. I'm just really sorry. I know it's really annoying. I was I was listening to it, and I was like, what is that? <laughs> I was trying to figure out if it was my bed squeaking or what, my leg, I don't know, but no, it's my floor. Sorry, so... Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and, um, subscribe. I don't know where it is. Subscribe and, um, yeah. Go watch my How to Organize Your Closet video if you haven't seen it already and I'll talk to all of you soon. Bye.